What is going on? LV here, and I'm back with another topic. In this topic, I want to speak on why I value our females. When I say why I value our females, we're speaking on the females all around the world, the queens, not the kings. We're speaking for the queens here, you know? Well, since I was young, the person I always looked up to, the person I had as my father figure was my mother. Yes, my mother was my father figure. I learned a very valuable lesson from my mother, and that's that a female could do the same thing a male could do, and that's true. When I was younger, I seen my mother get things done around the house. She had three kids. All three kids lived with her. It was me and my siblings. Also, it was her. She was the only female around the house. She was also my mother. See, my mother, she got things done. She used to go to the supermarket, walk, and come back with a handful of grocery bags that probably weighed it. It weighed it a lot. But yeah, she used to get that done by herself. She had to go to the supermarket and make sure that we had our food in the fridge. Sometimes I used to remember my mother, she used to have to pay a taxi or a cab driver because we didn't have no transportation. When she had got like a lot of grocery bags, probably about 20 bags. Sometimes when we wasn't home or where, when me and my brothers were nowhere to be found, my mother... She found a way to get those 20 grocery bags inside the house by herself. That's why I respect a female. She also taught me that a female, she could walk away from a man. When a man ain't acting right and when he's abusive, a female could also walk away from a man. I witnessed that. I witnessed my mother walking away from my father or from a abusive relationship. My mother also told me that you must respect your females and not hate your females. If you hate your female and if your female don't send you to jail, trust me, she might get tired of you she might end up something she didn't like, she didn't wish to do. But my mother told me not to hit a woman. But yeah, you know, I value my mother and I value females very much because of my mother. The second person who made me value a female much more as far as emotional level it had to be my ex-girlfriend. See, my ex-girlfriend, she was a good girl, very emotional. And that's something that I kind of learned around the way, that most females are emotional, you know. But females do have emotions. A female, if you cheat on her, if you do something wrong to her, she's always going to keep that behind her back, her mind. Excuse me. She's always going to keep that in back of her mind. That's something that I learned. Females don't forget. They don't. The old, the, another thing that I learned from my ex was that... You should not play with a female emotions, you know? You should respect your females. And you should value your females, you know? That's pretty much what I have to say. And that's pretty much what I learned from our females. 
Respect your female. Value your female. Females could be independent. Females could, could do a lot of things. Females could do the same thing a man could do. Also, now that we in the video, I just want to say that my mom, she was a hustler too. She hustled the same way a man will hustle. She will make the same money a man can make money. She was a woman who, she didn't have no job, but she found a way to make money and she found a way to put her clothes behind our back, food in our fridge. Usually it'd be the man who be hustling outside in the streets, but a female, she could hustle too, and I witnessed that. So yeah, I value a lot of females out there. Females are strong. Females are smart, independent, and they could do the same thing a man could do.